Hello, my name is Brandi Oldham. I am the Executive Director here at Gentiva. We are a hospice provider and company. Why hospice? Because hospice is a compassionate, patient-centered approach to medical care and support for people at the end of life and their families. It also can improve the quality of the day ahead for everyone involved. What is hospice? A lot of people ask. We're going to start off and talk about palliative care first, called comfort care. Provides relief to anybody with a serious illness through symptom and pain management. That brings us to hospice care. It is a form of palliative care. The hospice philosophy recognized death as the final stage of life and seeks to enable patients to continue an alert, pain-free life and to manage other symptoms so that their last days may be spent with dignity and quality surrounded by their loved ones. Who is eligible for hospice? You need to have a life-limiting illness, could be anything from Alzheimer's, cancer, heart disease, lung disease, liver, kidney disease, could be any other diseases also. You could require daily pain meds. You could have recurrent hospital visits. You must no longer be seeking curative treatment. The hospice benefit is available to anyone with a life expectancy of six months or less if the terminal illness or disease runs its normal course. The patient, of course, must choose to elect their hospice benefit, and the patient's eligibility must be certified by a physician's order. Also, say the patients don't pass in six months, yes, their benefits are still available to them. That We have some patients that have been on for a year or two. What does hospice cost? A lot of our patients ask or interested patients. Medicare Part A and Part B pays 100% of anything related to your hospice diagnosis. Medicaid pays 100% unless you have a spin down, then you must meet your spin down each month. VA benefits so far have always paid 100%. Private insurance pays 100%, but you must meet your deductible for the year. Why Gentiva? Why Gentiva over another hospice? Where will Gentiva provide their services? Well, let me answer that question for you. Wherever your home is, whether it's in a skilled nursing facility, a friend or family member's place, or the house you've been living in for many years, our hospice services allow patients to make the most of each day at home, surrounded by friends and family in a familiar, comfortable environment. Because at Gentiva, we believe that every moment matters. Our philosophy places our patients at the center of our care. We make every effort to match each patient's needs with the right clinician skills to achieve the best results. Some patients say, I have no family. Who will take care of me? We can make for sure you have a nurse, aide, and others that will come in, which is our field team, and take care of you five days a week. Our services that are offered are, we give you home medical equipment, medications that are with your hospice diagnosis, pain and symptom management are always under control. We also offer emotional and spiritual support, we have a comprehensive bereavement program that follows your family for 13 months after your passing. And we also services patients of all ages, not just our elderly patients. What does our field team consist of? We have an RN nurse that at least needs to visit you once every two weeks. That is the Medicare and Medicaid guidelines. We also have continuous care LPNs. Then it is between your RN nurse and you who decide how often or if you would like social workers, hospice aides, spiritual care coordinators, and our wonderful specially trained volunteers. We also have a physicians, which are our medical directors by Medicare and Medicaid laws that have to discuss your case every 14 days. We also have nurse practitioners on site. We have different levels of hospice care. Everybody is usually admitted into the routine home care. That is where you're taking care of your home, your skilled nursing facility, 
or wherever else you're admitted at. Sometimes patients are admitted into the hospital. That is considered our inpatient care. That's a higher level of care. That means you have symptoms out of control or they think you're going to pass within days. That is considered our general inpatient care. We also have respite care. Say your family's going on a vacation for a few days or they need to go out of town or maybe they just need a break. We have five days where we can place you in a skilled nursing facility. It's all 100% paid for and then you come back home to your loved ones again and you both have had breaks. We also have continuous care for caregiver relief at night so they can sleep or if you have pain out of control and we need to put a new med in place and you need to be monitored while you're starting that med and it's just too much for your family to handle. We have this wonderful hospice foundation through Gentiva. Gentiva's foundation mission statement is to support and educate persons and organizations dealing with life limiting illnesses. The commitment is to support deserving organizations and causes associated with hospice and palliative care and giving compassionate assistance to those at the end of life's journey. There are some programs associated with this hospice foundation. There is the patient and family assistance in which social workers can put in for to help with the patient's rent, any emergencies that might come up, food, utility bills, different levels of comfort care that hospice doesn't have that provides, or say miscellaneous items they feel they need. We have Last Wish, Wish Foundation, which is ran through the Dream Foundation. Say they want to take a family vacation and they're not quite there and they can still function. Say they want to take an anniversary dinner. The old couple has their 50th anniversary. We have that. In other states, we have a wall of remembrance at our inpatient units where they can purchase hearts. The foundation also has grants for special needs, the Dream Foundation, Children's Bereavement, which helps our Camp Willow Tree that is here in Indianapolis, Indiana and runs through late August and helps children who have lost their loved ones between 7 and 17 of those ages. We also have a palliative care for physicians program and educational programs. If you'd like to donate to this wonderful foundation, you can go online to www.gentiva.com and there's a tab about the foundation and on there you can see where you can donate online, by mail, or by phone. Last but not least, let's talk about our wonderful volunteers who make a difference. They provide grief and bereavement support to the families. They visit with the patients. They might play checkers. They might make crafts. They might do their nails. They might brush their hair. They also come in the office and help with administrative and clerical duties when we have people on vacation. We also have the mentally challenged handicapped volunteers that come in and help. So we're helping each other out with that. They also help organize a couple special events in the community. We have a butterfly memorial in the spring for the loved ones alive left of the deceased ones and we let a butterfly go in memory of them. We also have one at Christmas where we give away an ornament and the volunteers bring food. These are great rewards for caring. We specially train and provide comfort and support to patients and families in understanding the concepts of death and dying. Thank you for coming today. I hope I have educated you on what hospice is and I hope that if you were to choose a hospice you would choose Gentiva. I'll be available for the next 30 minutes to answer any questions you may have. Have a nice day.